It is really good to see your character develop over the seasons, and it kind of seems like he's less of an antagonist now. I mean, do you like the direction that Howard is taking? I get a lot of that about like, oh, you know, we, we, we kind of like Howard now. Uh, I always liked Howard. I thought Howard <laughs> was fine. Um, but it's funny, situationally, the way it was, I was delivered in the beginning, I looked like a real thorn in Jimmy's side. We find out in season two, and actually the end of season one, that I'm not really that bad of a guy. What I like playing about him is, uh, I think Howard is always looking out for the benefit of HHM. And he tries to maintain an equilibrium of being nice to people, but leading up until this season, we've seen that he'll pretty much do whatever he needs to do in order to protect that. And when you were first cast as Howard, did you know where your character was going at all? Did you think you were maybe getting to some drug deals in the future? Oh, it's, it's funny. Well, I'm a lawyer, so you assume there's dirty money, right? Absolutely. Um, but Vince and Peter had told me, this is a guy who life has smiled upon and like things go well for him. So my assumption was nothing's going bad for him at all, which is perhaps a setup for later on. And things are sort of, you know, degrading and chipping away at the veneer that is his life. I mean, uh, Howard wants to be on his boat. Howard wants to be golfing. Howard wants to be having dinner and getting new clients. And instead, he's having to get his hands dirty with all of this you know, human drama, which I don't think is his forte or what he wants to do.